everyone, Brandy here from CellPhoneTrek.com. Today I have with me the LG HBM210. It's definitely one of the cheaper options, seeing as how you can shop around and find them for around $15. When it comes to Bluetooth headsets, it's extremely simple and easy to use. The LG HBM210 is a Bluetooth that comes in a rectangular design. The front of the headset is shiny black plastic with blue horizontal stripes. The top front of the phone presses down is considered your multifunctional button. You also have a hidden LED light that is in the shape of a little phone. Your volume rocker is on the left and your charger jack is on the top. On the other side of your headset you have a non-removable earbud cover. It also comes with an ear hook that is removable if you would prefer not to use it. The ear hook is extremely flexible and can rotate to fit either ear. Here you have your multifunctional button. On the bottom your volume up, volume down, USB port in the back, and earbud on the inside. With the LG HBM210, you have about 11 hours of talk time and 400 hours of standby time. It should only take about two hours to fully charge that headset. The features that comes with the HBM210 are extremely basic. Some of the features include answering, ending, and rejecting phone calls. You have last number redial, call waiting support, voice dial support, and the capability to transfer calls to and from the headset and vice versa. To turn your 210 on or off, simply press the multifunctional button for four seconds. When you are making a call, it will immediately transfer to your headset. To answer a call, the headset will ring. To answer briefly, press the multifunctional button. To redial the last number dialed, hold down the multifunctional button for one second to activate the last number. The headset will then beep and will be redialing that number. This headset has call waiting as well, so if you want to answer a second call without hanging up on the first, press the multifunctional button for one second. And to return to the other call again, press the multifunctional button. And last but not least, to reject a phone call, press the multifunctional button for one second when the handset rings. As you can see, all of the functions revolve around the multifunctional button, so it is very, very easy to use. Again, this has been Brandy with CellPhoneTrek.com. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, and subscribe to us on YouTube. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.